Yo, what is up? Zeltic here, and we are back with some more Devil Survivor. Now, I just woke up. I'm a little bit lively when I wake up, which is weird. Most people are, like, groggy. But after I, like, wake up and eat, I feel good. Excuse me. I just burped into the mic. That is crazy. <laughs> Hope y'all didn't hear that, but that that's crazy. Anyways, here is the team. Uh, I didn't really grind. I just fused a lot. As you can see, that I only have, like, $2,000, if y'all seen that, and broke. Um, we still have the same party going for Kaz. I can't wait for them to reach their full potential. We need one more level on him for him to reach it. And we need one more level on this Yim. Or, hold on. Yeah, one more level on this Yim. Okay, good. We got him Hanu, man, because that other thing that he had, uh, if he's still here, I think I fused him. Nah, he's here. He was not cutting it. Bro was dying in, like, every battle he was in. I said, we gotta get this man this thing. And I even want to replace uh, Nagiri, but he's good for now. I got two Mothmans because not only is it a good healer for both like Yuzu and Midori, um, it's going to learn Endure and it has Devil Speed. So these two can move around like pretty much wherever they need to go to heal and also knock people off the map, which is what we need them for. And then we have power, of course, still. And then I gave her this thing. Um, and there was really no good skills for her left. She really has no good magic skills. I could put a dance thing on her, which is probably the best bet to go. Um, damn, my bad, y'all. The audio is acting weird. I don't know if y'all heard that. But anyways, electric dance. We got to give her, let's see. Kaz is pretty good with that ice stuff. I would probably send Kaz at somebody that needs ice. So the only thing we don't have... She has Mazan, doesn't she? Um, let's see here. We could give her Fire Dance. Then there's Force Dance, but her team already has pretty good Force. I'm gonna give her Fire Dance. Seems like we'd benefit from that. Yep, Zahn doesn't even have one. Yeah, Fire Dance. Yeah, I feel like that. that's fine. Fire Dance is good for her. And I got this so she can mute people with a high chance. Then again, she's going to learn that. So whenever she learns that, I'm probably going to make her learn something else. Probably put Ice Dance there so she can have access to two elemental attacks. Because I'm pretty sure these are both meant to be like the same. Hillers, High Magic, Glass Cannons probably. 256 HP. She has a little bit more... Oh, that's just because of Life Surge. Yeah. So, pretty much. They're, like, the damn same. <laughs> pretty much. Um. But, anyways. So, I asked around about Aya. Like, someone said in the comments. Until they told me that in two days, she he's gonna be with... Uh, I said he. In two days, the dude that she's with, Lady... Not Lady. Uh, fuck, why I keep fucking this up? Uh, Azuma. The dude Azuma that we talked to. She's there for him. So I don't know if she's cheating on Jin or whatever with that dude, but that's his guest or whatever. So he's going to be there on like the sixth day and we can talk to him about where Aya is and probably meet her. So I'm about to go tell him right now. See what happens. Hey, what's the matter? Did something happen? This Azuma guy. Kaz tells Jin he may be able to ask Azuma of the Shoman Kai about Aya. Azuma, eh? Yeah. Supposedly, he's going to be at the Hills Building at noon in two days. The Hills Building in two days at noon. All right, thanks. Maybe this will give me a lead on Aya's whereabouts. Yeah, he definitely knows where she is. Oh! I can't tell you how much this means to me. Thanks, guys. Oh, bro, he's about to murk you, though. Yo, he's about to murk him. Oh, nah, y'all. What the heck? All right, so there's nothing to do except for talking to Atsuro. Bro, he's gonna murk him. Hey, I've been thinking, where do you think Naoya designed and built the server? His apartment? <laughs> Definitely the Shomunkai with all that tech. I think so, too. The Shomunkai hired an outsider to build this important system. I doubt they'd let him work without keeping an eye on him. Naoya must have designed the program in a Shomunkai facility. Spit it out already. <laughs> you want to look for it? I'm thinking about it. Amani's challenging us, and I really want to find it now. If Naoya designed the system, he most likely had direct access to it. 
if we searched where he was working, I thought there might be some clues there. Hmm. We should hurry then. Well, of course we should look soon, but what's the rush? What do you mean? Didn't you hear Azuma? Crap, that's right! Dumbass nigga. That guy said they were going to clear out Naoya's room. We gotta get there soon. But what are we gonna tell them? We can't just walk up and ask to see Naoya's room. Yeah, we can. <laughs> no problem. I'm his cousin. Yeah, facts. Huh? Hey, that's right. Okay, let's go try that. If a blood relative asked for Naoya's personal belongings, we might have a chance. I swear somebody called Naoya my brother one time, though, for some reason. I don't know why. Oh, man. I'm so glad you're with us. All right. Let's see. Will it really help? Maybe some source code. Maybe even a memo. We need all the help we can get. Uh, what did Azuma say? They were going to clean out Naoya's room tomorrow? Let's go back to the Shomunkai facility before then, so we can snag Naoya's stuff. Right. Okay. Ooh, Haru. We definitely need to talk to Haru before she does some crazy stuff. There's a battle here for some reason. And then... Ooh, there's so many people we could talk to. Um... And this is the Shomenkai facility. Technically, we don't even need to talk to Haru until she tries to kill herself, right? Let me save my game. Because if I make one wrong move here, somebody's life could be gone. Somebody's life could be gone. Um. There he is! It's that guy! If we don't hurry, they might throw away all the stuff in Naoya's room. Come on, let's go! Hmm. What's the matter? Forget something? Not really. There's something we'd like to talk to you about concerning Naoya. Naoya. What about him? What do you mean, what about him? And then we know that you're smuggling Aya, too. This dude's weird. Give him to get his things. Or I'm gonna say I'm his cousin. Hmm. He did say that he had a cousin going to high school. May I ask you for your name? Bro, bro, why do you want my name, hmm. though? I can see the resemblance between the two of you. Oh, yeah, it's obvious. So, uh, can we take the stuff that now you left behind in his room? I see. If you're hoping to find anything, I must inform you otherwise. I knew it, bro. I don't know why y'all thought it was gonna be so that easy. What he left behind is of no use to anyone. Really? Then let me see it then. No blueprints, no memos, no personal notes of any kind. Bro, he's basically they're admitting that they already searched his room. <laughs> All he left behind are some files of numbers and symbols that have no meaning. We want them anyways. You really don't mind taking it? Hmm, I see. If you insist that much, then by all means, you can have them. Please come back tomorrow. Got you. We will have them gathered up by then. Thanks a lot. Well then. Okay. Now, Haru. Oh, it's you. You're... <laughs> Never mind. You keep at it, okay? Huh? Oh, Haru! What is she talking about? Keep at it. She's gone. Hey, what did Haru's death clock say? Zero, obviously. <laughs> so, today really is Haru's last. No, I refuse to let that happen. Let's rescue her. For real, every time we've talked to Haru, her death clock's been zero. <laughs> um. Now what? Only thing we can do is just battle here. You want to die, punk? Give me your wallet and your food. Or I'll feed you to my demon. What the fuck? Bro said, all right, give me your wallet, your food, but, but I don't have anything, your social. I swear, nothing. <laughs> huh. You got some kind of death wish, do you? Our pal saw you coming out of a nice apartment building, you know. You better not be trying to make fools of us demon tamers. <laughs> what a pain in the ass. Might as well kill him and take his keys. Oh my. Ah, someone help me! <laughs> you think you can get away from my demons? Bro, that's How crazy. How dare he summon demons to threaten people? Hey, are you gonna let this injustice slide? I'm not letting this shit slide. Let's go. 
Let's rescue that man. Yes. Huh. What the hell are you brats looking at? You want a one-way ticket to hell too? I can't forgive bullies who would oppress the good people of the world. What? He's some kind of idiot. She kind of is, but j just let <laughs> just let her slide, bro. Oh, help! Please help me! Hey, you're not going anywhere, you bastard. All right, let's go. Let's go into the fight. Let's do it. Ah, help me! I got you. <laughs> Give it up. See what skill we can crack. Every time we do human fights, I always wonder like if they <laughs> give us a cool a auto skill or girl. something. Well, you sure? There's no more police, no more laws, absolutely no one to protect you. Okay, you say that like when we're not about to fuck you up. No one's gonna come running when you cry. <laughs> yeah, we'll treat you real nice. Hey, yo, no, 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 no. So nah. dumb. Sure, the police are gone, but so's the value of money. <laughs> You're more immature than I thought, little girl. Money's gonna have big meaning if we get outside this damn lockdown. You're not getting out. You have three days. Once our demons are strong enough, the SDF's nothing to fear. We'll plow through them. Yo, that idea does sound pretty cool. I ain't gonna lie. It's, one time a villain actually says something smart. Uh, you can't use comps for evil. Bro, let them, bro. Bro, bro. Okay, think about it, right? Technically, if we don't stop, if we don't release demons on the sdf we're still good people if they did it they're the bad guys but still they, they saved us they got us out of the lockdown is it it's a necessary evil i ain't gonna lie it's a necessary evil but fine fine you can't use comps for evil fine yeah let's take away their comps fine bro we're just treating the sdf like they're treating us though because if we try to get out of lockdown what are they gonna do shoot us we're just treating them like they're treating us technically but anyways Ooh, battle aura. Nullify damage? I have no clue what this does. Battle aura. I don't know what I'm reading. Nullifies damage equal to 50? What does that even mean? Y'all gonna have to explain that shit to me. But I'm gonna crack that on him. Then we could get... Um... Anti-electric, I guess. And then anti-fire on this guy. Let's do it. I want anti-ice. Somebody told me to get Bridget and put anti-ice on her. And she's going to carry me. And I, I want to do that. <laughs> that sounds like... Sounds like pretty promising. All right, anyways. Uh, that's convenient. We'll be taking those off your hands now. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Laugh it up, laugh it up. I thought this was the same, like, Yakuza guy from last time. This is, like, a different one. All right, you know what? I'm going to move Kaz, like, right here. Because those first two guys... Our, uh, let's see. Yuzu has to take down one of these guys. Okay, this guy. And we got devil speed. You know what I'm saying? We got the devil speed, so we can, we can get on his... Dang, this devil speed is... Dang, that's a wide coverage. Alright, don't get folded, Yuzu. I'm gonna fall with you seriously in a minute. Don't get folded. Alright, they're weak to... Nice, they're weak to electricity. Nice. Um, there's all strong against Zon. I'm just gonna attack. And then use Mighty Hit. Let's see what happens. Mmm! Yo. User just wrecked him. <laughs> I didn't expect her to go that crazy. Ain't even gonna lie. To, I mean, for now, actually, we can. It doesn't really matter. Damn. All right, here. You destroyed the comp. Yeah, get out of here. All right, nobody's like assigned to take this dude down. We just gotta.
Y'all got Fortify? Like, I care? Like, I was still not about to get beat up? Yeah, that was mid damage, but it still it was enough to kill one of them. Zero's poison. How? All right, cool. We still got second skirmish because of this now Guri. here use mow down and then go ham on the middle guy nice I'll remember this wait I didn't mean that yeah shut up before I take your comp I already destroyed that thing dang I thought we was taking comps well then again no why would we take comps it doesn't make sense um all right so she can use double speed too I would say let's go ahead and um okay Xero needs to fight him Midori doesn't have to fight anybody necessarily I'm gonna get her up beside him and then heal him Dang, they didn't actually, they didn't cure him of his, uh, status. Kinda sucks. Oh, shoot, I forgot about the worker! Yo, he's about to get jumped! I forgot about the worker. <laughs> My bad, y'all. Bro, if I lose this mission, I'm gonna be upset, though. For real, for real. Alright. Uh, no, 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 no. Brutal hit. What is he weak to? Okay, nice. This works out in our favor. Well, Hanu Man is freaking over your petrified. It would have worked out in our favor. So stupid. Dang, we didn't even take one of them out. That's sad. We suck, Loki. You, you guys are demon tamers too. Bro, calm down. Don't be scared. I'm gonna save you. Just have faith in us. Wait, are are you the girl who saved me from demons yesterday? Yes. Uh, thank goodness. <laughs> okay, I trust you. Okay, they're finally all right. Yes, please get out of here, bro. Please get out of here, bro. All right, so. Kaz. I don't know what I was thinking going outside of this thing. Um, I don't even know. You can't even attack out. Bro, what, what am I on? I don't know what I was doing with that earlier placement. I ain't even gonna lie. Um, can I attack this dude? Mm. Oh, I can. I didn't even know that. Sad part is, we can't really kill them. We just gotta make it easier for Xero. Because I wanna crack all these skills. There we go. You wanna try Yuzu, bro? You wanna try Yuzu, bruh? What's up? Alright. Watch your dance. Could do Mazan. Um, they're all strong against it, though. And then... I'd say Mighty Hit on whoever's still left. Why y'all jumping Mothman like that, bro? Chill. Bro, come on, bro. I 
Almost. We're barely doing damage. Bro, that still wasn't enough. We gotta use a second skirmish to kill him, bro. That is actually sad. Like, I know one of my party members is kind of, like, incapacitated right now, technically. But, alright, finally, we got it. Okay, nah, we're not gonna set it. Damn it! All right, all right. Yeah, get out of here, bro. Wasting my time, bro. Chill. All right, I'm gonna move him like right here, so he doesn't get to that guy, and then. Yeah, we gonna. Can't take him out, but we can make it easier for Kaz. Where are they weak to? Fire? Okay, this definitely works out then. He blocks us? Wait, what does Battle Aura even do then? I'm so confused. He doesn't, because he doesn't block fire, but, yo, I'm about to silence these guys, silence the main guy, nice, still packs a punch though, alright, I'm liking Midori, she's way better than Kaisuke, I ain't even gonna lie to y'all. Yeah, Tsuro's dead, bruh. We got one of them petrified. We got... <laughs> I mean, he fought the good fight, though. It's, it's fine. Oh my gosh! Jeez, I didn't even know that. <laughs> like, they could just break it like that. That's crazy. Um. Alright, we take down this guy. You guys are monsters! Bruh, <laughs> not gonna lie, that voice actor in the studio did not know what was going on. Damn, Damn it, you guys, guys are, are monsters! Strong. It's not worth it! Time to run! He's running away! We gotta stop him and get his comp! Dang, he's gonna run? Kaz! Kaz! Yo! Guys, we need you, bro. We need you to tighten up, bro. Um, I'm going to end that turn. Hopefully. Kaz. Okay, we can reach him. Nice. Nice. All right, this this ends now, bro. This ends now, bro. Um, I don't know what Battle Aura does, but I'm still going to go for the fire attack. Then I'm I'm guessing See what happens. Oh my goodness. 400 is insane. Okay, nice. He goes before him again. Okay, 
I don't even think there's no point in really healing him, but we're gonna do it anyways. Cracked Battle Aura. Spam in the comments what that does. I'm actually confused about that. Pretty curious about that skill. Set the skill. Nah, I don't know what it does right now. All right, here, take it. Destroyed the comp. Yeah, get your ugly ass out of here, nigga. What is wrong with you? Trying to prey on the innocent. There is one dude here, and y'all trying to jump in this stuff. That's crazy. Th thank you. I'm so glad there are demon tamers like you out there. But. Most people consider tamers to be crooks, so be careful. Yeah, 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 gotcha, gotcha. Thanks, and bye bye Take care of yourself now. I'm so glad we were able to save that man and take those bullies' cops away. Yeah, and he actually saw the light. See, you gotta... It's crazy how, at first, Kaisuke was trying to convince Midori, but Midori's probably gonna be the one that has to convince Kaisuke that what he's doing is wrong. We can't be all that happy with the situation. The more people abuse the comps, the bigger the grudge against demon tamers gets. For real. Ugh, how can they abuse the power of the comps like this? I'm surprised they haven't got mad at the Shomenkai yet. It is what it is, don't be like them, okay? Yeah, for real. Of course not! If you let your power go to your head, you'll never be a real hero. With great power comes Still, great responsibility. we don't know how many altered comps got out. If everyone starts misusing the comps, the lockdown isn't going to be enough. People might start thinking about taking on the SDF with their demons and breaking out. That Hey, I'm telling you, that's not even a bad thing, though. Is it? That's not even a bad thing. Think about it. Demon tamers and the self-defense force in a head-to-head -head battle? Nobody inside or outside the lockdown area is going to be safe if that happens. Then we have to stop it. <laughs> Let's not get involved. Yeah, that's right. I don't want that to happen. I'm gonna help you stop it. <laughs> it really would be for the best. There aren't a lot of people strong enough. I don't want to sound stuck up, but I think we have the best chance of being able to do it. For real, anybody we come across is getting dropped. Wowza! That sounds hot! Hey! We have to do our best! Uh, hey, Midori. Don't you think you're standing a little close to him? <laughs> All right. So, Haru's gonna die pretty soon. There's another battle with Kaido and Honda. Like, these are fun. I'm not even gonna lie. Um, but, what about that woman, though? We haven't talked to her in a while. She predicted the riots would happen, and now they're happening, so I wanna talk to her. Oh, we meet again. Nice. There's something I wanted to ask you. What's up? I've heard about people with altered comps summoning demons. Isn't that you guys? <laughs> Maybe. Wow, that was quick. It's okay to admit it to me, but keep it under your hat, okay? A lot of people have started using demons to perform evil deeds. So now, demon tamers are generally seen as enemies. Do you really want to fight other people? No, but if I have to, it is what it is. <sighs> I had a feeling it was gonna go like this. I've gathered a bit more info since we last met. Now I have a better grasp on things. Tell me your prediction. She might as well have a crystal ball. <laughs> How much do you know? What's your scoop? Let's see. Angels and demons really do exist. And why the lockdown had to happen now. Yes. Angels. I saw them with my own eyes. They look different from the demons. With white wings and shining with light. They seem to be giving orders to the self-defense force troops in the blockades. What? Giving orders to the self-defense force? Are you sure about that? Yeah, I thought I was just seeing a beautiful demon at first too, but that's not it. I quickly knew that they weren't the same creatures at all. Just looking at them, I felt this kind of awe and fear. It was an angel. Okay, so the lockdown was planned by angels? I looked into those altered comps that you're carrying. It seems a cult called the Shomenkai are responsible for their development. Well, we knew that, and with Nalia's help. And the Shomenkai were holding a summer conference the day of the lockdown. 
the comps are only in the hands of high-ranking fanatical Shaman Kai members. Yo, we should go and take all of them down. I was thinking that's probably what the game's leading up to. Us taking down the Shaman Kai higher-ups. And of course, those members would take part in the cult's special activities. The government knew about demons, and they knew most of the cult would be here. Oh. So they locked down all of downtown Tokyo. So the government's against the Shomen Kai. That is the truth I have unraveled from the tangled mass of information available. Most likely, it was the angels who told the government about demons and ordered this. H how can you be so sure? Facts, though. I mean, like, she was right the first time. She was like, yo, on the fourth day, riots are going to happen. People are going to die. That's exactly what happened. Like, and if she's saying that angels are controlling the SDF and told the government that demons would be here and the Shulman Kai is here, lock that hoe down. They're, shoot, she's probably right. Even if there are angels working with the SDF, like you say, why are you certain that angels are behind the lockdown? Do you believe in God? Huh? No. I mean, I've never been religious at all. Then why does my question upset you so much? God could not possibly be the cause of whatever drove us all into this situation. If there is a God, he wouldn't leave innocents like us in this horrible place. Is that what you're thinking right now? Is that why you're so nervous? Is it because you believe somewhere in your heart that God has to be on your side? That is a fact. That, that is a fact. I don't talk about religion on this channel, but... I am a believer. That, that is a fact. W wait, that's... Well, whatever. What about the rumor that we're all going to die in three days? Have you learned anything new about it? Nothing, really. I mean, you saw special forces. What? Special forces? Hey, that's right. Yeah, they wouldn't let us out. Right when the lockdown began, unnumbered SDF helicopters were seen flying in the city. That must have been how they got here. The SDF Special Task Force is a unit that has never been disclosed by the government. In times of emergency, it has the authority to take command of military or civil agencies. From what I hear, they're completely ruthless in carrying out their missions. Please tell me where I can find them. Yeah, try that. Yeah, you'll find them if you go to the tunnel. Uh-huh. Thanks for the tip. I'm going to keep seeing what I can dig up. Catch you later. All right. Be safe, bruh. Be safe. Shows you leaves in a hurry. She's like useful. Like she doesn't even have demons, and she's over here maneuvering the city like that. Getting First all this demons info. now angels. This is all getting more and more unbelievable. It's been pretty unbelievable for a while now. <laughs> We've just gotten used to it. That's so true. Let's go. We have a lot of things to do today, don't we? Yeah, we gotta go save Haru now. There's Kaisuke running around, and then there's Haru. Oh, yeah, and they still do let us do this battle, which I'm trying to do. Most definitely we'll save the game. Yeah, this game is getting wild. I still remember, like, the first time I played this game sleeping in the cemetery. Like that. After that, I was like, this game can take me anywhere. I just passed the amusement park. You see people screaming and running away. More demons? Let's hurry, or it'll be too late! Hey, why are you running away? You want a piece of me, right? Come and get it. Wait, why is he fighting regular people? Ah, save me! <laughs> like I'm just gonna let you go. Hey, you guys! I won't allow you to prey on the weak! Huh? What do you want? These puppies decided to bark at the wolves. Shouldn't they be taught proper respect? Kaido, I thought you were better than this. He's basically doing the same thing as Keisuke. You could have used your demon to run away from them safely. Why even retaliate? If you're going to unleash demons on regular people, we won't stand by and watch. Stop yelling, will ya? You're giving me a headache. If you want to protect them, give it your best shot. But I'm still gonna kill them. What? Oh my gosh, bruh. Defeat their... No, I'm helping the citizen escape. I don't even know what that second one said. What is wrong with this nigga? And Honda's helping him? Bro, if y'all wanna... Well, my thing is, if you wanna fight, right? If you wanna fight, uh... Drain hit, restore HP equal to... 
Yo, that sounds fire. Who has that? Kaido? Shoot. Kaz, do that. Nullifying, like, completely nullifying force attack sounds good. He also has that. Um. Okay, well, I guess we're not getting that. I want Drain Hit instead. We can cop a Mana Surge from Honda. Let's do that. Or from this thing. I'd rather get one from Honda though. Alright. Let's do this. So why do I keep doing that, y'all? Do that every video. This is gonna be hard. They're already in Are the middle scared? of all of it. Huh? Please run. Oof. Paralyze one of them. Alright, Kaz, come on. We gotta get to uh get to him and time. I see what y'all mean. Devil Speed is really, like, necessary. Like, it helps a lot. It's a good for granted in the early game. Honda, not you too, I hope bro. you were aware this would happen to you. Bro, y'all are some... Bro. I gotta stop cussing on YouTube as much Stay as I do, but y'all... Bro. Come on, now. Save us at least. No, <gasps> save me. Stop. Somebody save me. Ah, save me. I don't want to die. I'm saved. All right, one of them got out. Dang, we're all, like, bundled up here. Like, jeez. Can't really move. You gonna attack from that far away? Yo, Kaido has 660 HP? Yo. We gotta knock this man off, for real, for real. Here we go. You're being a total jerk. You damn justice freaks annoy the hell out of me. Get him, Pazuzu! What's up? I don't care about you or your Pazuzu. We'll see week two. Ice? That might actually be... <laughs> Alright, maybe, maybe I'm a little scared. That might be a problem. But... Here we go. Wait. Oh, drain hit. Okay. Alright, never mind. I thought I was like... Okay, never mind. I thought I was tweaking. He nullifies it, so I can't even... His Pazuzu goes down first. Dang, but I won't even be able to get Drain Hit if I... I'm, like, on a roll. I could... Oh, shoot, he just killed my Mothman. Okay, that might be a problem. Uh, <laughs> I was gonna say I'm on a roll, but... Yo, this might be a problem now. <laughs> if we just attack, maybe we'll be able to kill it. Yeah, nice. Alright. Good, good job, Yuzu. Alright, recharm. Reach recharm. Reach we'll nervous. We could have we could have did some serious damage there, but I wanna crack drain hit. That's the only reason why that man is not dead right now. Um, yeah, actually... Hold on. Did I put Midori after Honda? Tsuro, Yuzu, 
And yeah, Midori. Nice. We could devil speed her and have her go around. Does this reach? Should reach. Nice. Keep on running. Thank you. Thank you. It should reach him. Oh my goodness, bro. Fine, fine, fine. I'm gonna just end this turn. Start sending them up this way. Nice. I gotta get devil speed on cast too. Jeez, bro. Alright, so what is he weak to? Ice? He's dead. Drain it is broken in this game. Jeez. Drain sucks in all the other games, but it is broken in this one. Drain hit. Yeah, I don't have enough for that. Yo, if we could give that to Tsuro, though, he is going to be broken. Tsuro is actually going to be really good. Like, not just good, but really good. Honda, what the fuck are you- Don't kill her, please. Zero, make your way over there. As fast as you can. Dang, it does not even reach. enough is it that fun to pick on someone weaker than you for real i know you're like bro your son's having surgery right now and you over here beating They're up the ones civilians. who attacked us first they deserve this i mean yeah yeah that is messed up but throw some hands at them bro you don't gotta unleash demons on them like that's crazy all right so what they're weak to electricity fire it doesn't matter i'm over here talking like that stuff matters with the serious team um Dang. Nothing is ever weak to force in this game. I feel like that's a waste, like, dude. Your Honda's about to die. You about to die, buddy. Attack again. About to be gone. He about to be gone. Hit the like button if you want him to be gone. If you want him to be gone. Bop. 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 He done. Mana Surge. He is done. Nope. It's time for me to retreat. I can't allow myself to die here. See, we're not even just showing like the game itself that we're built different. We're even showing these, the the um the social link characters. I know it's not called a social link in this game, but you know what I mean. We're showing them. We're showing them that we're built different as well. And since I already cracked the witch and call it, shoot, you're not even worthy to have Kaz finish you off. Kaido doing some dumb stuff like that. Yuzu's about to handle you. Yuzu actually probably would have killed him by herself if I wasn't waiting on Drain Hit. Yuzu's actually really good. I remember at first she was so trash. Now she's like super good. Out of here. 
This is stupid. I've had enough of this. Mm-hmm. Goodbye. Goodbye. How could they do this to normal people? I can't believe this! <laughs> Cheesed off. Why would what? they picking on people weaker than him? Normal people can't fight demons. Most demon tamers don't fight back, like you, Midori. He must have gotten carried away. Yeah, I probably would have still fought. Not like, but like self-defense. Like I wouldn't have like took a demon out. Like I would have done what Yuzu said. I would have took a demon out to run away or to like defend myself. Maybe take my hits, but not like. I wouldn't just shrivel up like Midori and just get beat on. But I'm not about to kill anybody either. Let's see, Kaido's gone too far. Yeah, he, he That's really true, did. but we might have done the same thing if we were in Kaido's place, you know? What do you mean? What type of place is Kaido in? He seems to be doing better than everybody else. Does it that just seem sounds to like an you excuse. that Kaido's gotten a lot stronger? Exactly. I know he's been gathering Maka to strengthen his demons for a while, but... Bro's HP was at like 600 something. Yeah, you're right. Why is he getting so strong? What's he planning? That vampire demon. I can't wait to continue that story for that. I want to fight that vampire demon so bad. World domination. <laughs> Conquering the world, huh? He might be seriously considering that. Knowing him. The rift between demon tamers and normal people has gotten even wider now. Yeah. Hey, it's 1700. Remember what the Laplace mail said would happen? Please be careful. Yeah, all right, time to save the game. And we need to help Haru. That's what this episode boiled down to all along, y'all. Let's go talk to her. <sighs> Haru is lost in thought, staring at the lock down Shibuya station. She is muttering to herself and doesn't seem to notice you. The demons. They're tormenting people. They corrupt people's minds. The demons. Is it because I summon the demons? Everything is my fault. All of Tokyo. Bro, you did not summon the demons, bro. Chill out. It's not true. <laughs> when did you get here? So you heard me. <laughs> There's no use hiding it. I don't need your pity. I was the one who summoned the demons with my songs. I... I'm the one who destroyed Tokyo. No. Demons were already here. <laughs> That's a laugh. That can't be true. Where's any proof of that? Haru, do you know about those murders where the victim's blood was drained? Yeah, the bodies were found without any blood at all in them, I heard. Wouldn't it make more sense if the murderer was a demon? Huh? What are you getting at? Those killings started more than six months ago. So... The demons were here in the city before I summoned one? Yes, yeah, horror. You ain't special. <laughs> See? And, hey, if you're not happy, you're gonna make me all depressed, too. Right. So stop being depressed about this. Be the Haru we know and love. <laughs> I see. So that's how it is. <laughs> and to think that I... I completely jumped to the wrong conclusion. <laughs> Man, that is so unlike me. Thanks for making me realize that. I was gonna make a huge mistake. You saved me. Nice! Haru thanks you and leaves. Hey, how many days does Haru have left? Did it still say zero? <laughs> What's zero plus two? Huh? It's two, but... Nah, don't, don't give me no but because we also only have two days. Well, then again, we know why, though. We have to fight... Uh, What's that dude's name? Something with fire. Something hey, with fire. are you saying that her death clock went up to two? Woohoo! So that Laplace mail was about Haru after all. Mm hmm But it's two, huh? That's one day less than most people. I wonder why. Yeah. Still, this is great! I mean, we were able to save her! So, so far, nobody that I know of has died. We also gotta keep an eye out for Jin, because he also, I think, only has two days left to live. 
I feel like Aya's gonna kill him or something. Like that dude is gonna kill him. Something is gonna happen to him. So I we gotta Haru was watch planning out for to him. commit suicide. She thought she brought the demons over. Oh God. Oh man, I'm so glad we were able to save her. Yuzu, we've had to save Haru so many times. It's not new, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, a lot of people would be sad if they never got to hear her sing again. Yo, alright, now it's just me and Kaido. What's he doing? Let me save. This day was pretty good. It was, it was pretty laid back compared to the other days. Really just me, like, gaining money, getting new demons, uh, you know. Yo, Justice Freaks. Who are you calling freaks? You're the one sicking your demons on normal people. It's because of guys like you that demon tamers get... Ah, uh, shut the hell up. Your mouth never closes, does it? Dang. I didn't come here to hear you jabber on about that, so zip it and listen to me. Damn, this nigga. Alright. What? There's no way we're gonna talk to you after everything that's happened. Hey, calm down, Yuzu. Kaido came here because there's something that he thinks is important to hear. <laughs> Hurry up and spit it out then. <laughs> I got something I need to ask you. Some of the demons have been attacked by demon tamers. I'm looking to settle this with the punks that did it. It ain't you guys, is it? Wait, what? What happened? <laughs> My bad. I'm like listening, but I zoned out for a second. Um, I'm looking to settle this with the punks who did Wait, what? That's what I thought. I never really thought it was you guys anyway. They did what? Anyway, some of my guys have been killed. I have to set an example for my other demons. So de demon tamers are killed? Uh, bro, isn't that what you were trying to do though? One of the survivors said the bastard that did it was wearing glasses. Oh, yeah. The demon with him was talking about the judgment of justice or some crap. We gotta jump Kaisuke, bro. you know bro. anything about that? Buh. Bro, I don't like Kaisuke though, bro. He's trash. I'm not protecting this man. What? What? what we don't know anything. <laughs> Why do we know that? Of course, it's Zero defends him, bro. Bro, forget defending him. He's killing people now. He's already killed people. He, he's already a murderer now, bro. Huh? I see. This is gonna be even more of a pain in the ass then. Well. I'm not surprised if somebody's out to get us. We are a bunch of scum. <laughs> Someone with a chip on his shoulder must have gotten a comp and wants revenge. Dealing with these bloodless murders is more important to me, though. Mari's in danger. Yeah, facts. I want to help with that, too. Yeah, but since this is getting so much attention, I have to set an example to my crew. Damn that four-eyed bastard. When I find him, I'm gonna kill him. Sorry for taking your time. I'm gonna get going. Hey, do you think Kaido's looking for... I thought so. We don't know for sure, but after seeing him today... But... I don't want to believe that Keisuke could do such a horrible thing. We should have never showed him the Laplace, no, man. But Zero, why did you do that? <laughs> We should have just never showed him. I wonder how Midori's gonna react when we show her the Laplace mail. Because she, she already didn't, um believe that you know she has two days left to live she didn't believe the death clock so who knows how she's gonna react yeah neither do i but if it does turn out to be keisuke let's stop keisuke let's get kaido to stop we can deal with both yeah we'll need time to persuade keisuke to change his mind to do that though we have to keep kaido from finding him first oh uh, that's gonna be a pain mm, it sounds good but can we really do it? Well, we'll have to give it our best shot. We should figure out how to distract Kaido first. We could create some other situation for him to deal with instead of finding Keisuke. Okay, that sounds nice. Ooh, Mari. Bet, I haven't talked to her in a minute. But dang, that sounds like a, kind of confusing. Y'all gotta teach me how to do that. Or like what, what I could do to actually save Keisuke. Even though I really don't care about saving Keisuke. I mean, he's over here murdering people. And then Red was like, if we give up, we'll protect the people. And I was like... <laughs> what the heck? I'm gonna just say, uh-huh. Hey! Are you even listening to me? <laughs> huh? What's the matter, Yoohoo? 
<sighs> I'm doomed to be you who forever, aren't I? <laughs> That's not important right now. So what's up? That woman who went past us just now, wasn't that Mari? Huh? Miss Mari? I mean, it looked like she was wearing a nurse's coat. She seemed to be in a hurry. She was in a hurry? Did something happen? We should follow her just in case. What is she doing? What is that? What is that? Yo, is that the... That's the uh, vampire. Yo. You thought you could escape, did you? You really thought you could make it? Well, you were wrong. It doesn't get any wronger than you. Kudlock. Kudlock. Right now, you're just a brave little human. Doesn't that frustrate you? Isn't it sad? Hey, it is Miss Mari. Look, there's a demon attacking her. Damn it. Get away from her, you freaking demon. Run to somewhere safe, Miss Mari. We'll take care of that thing. No, you must not defeat Kudlock. Leave this place at once. Why? What? You are Miss Mari, right? I don't think she is. Her name has question marks. You shall have your details later. For now, you must run. If defeated, Kudlock will come back to life, gaining greater power. Stay your hands. But her death clock says zero. What? Uh, okay. I don't quite get you, but... <laughs> That's what she's like, if you want to die. We will speak later. Focus on your escape. Question for you. Do you think you can escape my poison fangs? Never mind. I already know the answer. Everyone, even these kids, will die. Bro, what? I'm so confused now. If Mari dies, Kaz's party dies. Bro, if Mari dies, that's her fault. <laughs> at this point, that's where I'm at. Could get Dia Rahan. That's just a skill. That'd be, that'd be pretty nice. Uh. Just have everybody do that, I guess. Alright, Yuzu's gonna go over there by herself. I feel like she can hold her own. And then... Now, in this situation, which way will be the most suitable escape? Going down the stairs, go through the park... Go down the stairs. That way requires a means of bypassing Kudlock. Do you have a plan in mind? For the time being, I will go through the park. Ah. All the way over there, bro. If you had to pass Kudlock, it wouldn't be that bad. Just push him out the way for a second. <laughs> whatever, whatever. All right. So we're not supposed to defeat him because he's just going to come back even stronger. That sounds dangerous. I feel like every YouTuber has that moment where they're just sitting in their room recording something. And then there's just somebody outside, like, mowing the lawn. Like, yo. Going crazy on that lawn, bro. Okay, devil speed. Let's see, can we reach one of these demons? We could get very close, but... I honestly, like, really think that Yuzu can... You know what? You know what? No, 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 no. <laughs> I say that, and then we get wrecked. I'm playing it safe. <laughs> I've missed you? What? So she is a demon, or she's, like, part demon or something. Krennic or Krenznik or something like that. I miss you so much. I could kill you. What shall we merge? Good luck, you. What's wrong? You don't look so good. You don't look good at all. 
So they have some type of like bond or connection or something. Okay, healing yourself. Good. She only moved one step though. That's stupid. Ah. I don't like this. I do not like this. Confused at what may happen. Um. You could attack this thing, but it's too risky. I really wish I could attack that. We have to get Kudlock to move. Um. Is that what you really want? You want me? You really want to kill me? Me? Bro. Did you just call me a lady? Oh, I'm royally pissed now. Damn. No, you must not kill him. Bro, we're not gonna kill him. But his lackeys can get killed. The Loas? Um. Let's see here. Mmm, that damage. F that drain and I'm just gonna attack him. 98 is pretty good. Should be able to attack again. That's gotta be Miss Mari. But I am, yet I am not. I will explain later. <laughs> that is so strange. Okay. That attack should kill it. So I'm gonna just do guard on everybody else. Maybe. Yup. Okay, all the lackeys are dead. Good. Healing yourself. Okay, she's moving further now. They're coming towards us. Uh. <laughs> Kaz is just stated here. I don't know. We can't really move past it, zero. Uh. There's really not much Kaz can do. It's really up to Yuzu and Mari. Or not Mari, my bad. Midori. Mari's about to get herself killed. No! Oh, she took him out. Nice. She, she not weak. <laughs> she, she said, I'm not weak, bro. <laughs> I am not weak. Alright, using Yuzu, we're gonna run past this first one. Go here. Should be able to make it in time. If we can take these guys out. Electric Dance. Uh... These two on the other side aren't strong against it, so. And then Mighty Hit on the middle one. Good shit, good shit. Alright. I'm thinking... Mazon. And possibly... Mow down. 
Yes. Ooh, nice. All right, we could give him... What else would be pretty good on him? Mazon, Media. Let's give him a fire attack. Or no, 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 no. Let's give him ice. Let's give him mob beefy. Third week to wind. Let's see what happens. All of them got silenced. Let's go. Didn't kill it, but we didn't do bad at all. Let's see here. Actually, I like the skills that she has right now. You don't need that. Good girl. Kaz literally cannot move. <laughs> like... And there's no point. There's like, I should have probably swapped the the roles. If I'm being honest. Okay. Yes. And run. She's only going like one step. Okay, I can go... Nice, finally. I can go ahead and attack. Ah, wait, hold on. Whatever, whatever. This is actually good. This is good for now. Yeah, we got this in the bag. We got it. All I gotta do is keep it zero, like, right behind her like this. And then, we can sack this thing. Mow down. Or, actually, brutal hit. Uh, yeah. And a brutal hit. Ah, oh, dang, it jumps in the way anyways. That was like a waste. Note to self, this is why you always take out the lackeys, no matter what. Even if you don't feel like it. Nice. We got this in the bag, y'all. So, in this turn, Kaz is just like, bro. <laughs> Alright, using Devil Speed, we should be able to get, like, right next to her, and she should be able to escape. She's already full, but I'm still gonna need you. Nice. You stay put. Now let's just see how it plays out. I 
I don't know if the condition said if anybody dies, so if Zero ends up dying, I'm gonna be upset if it, we lose. Now she's using D on me, appreciate that. Kaz is just chilling. What if he just? I'm just. I've been thinking this whole time. What if the vampire just somehow just teleports right next to her? Just all of a sudden, I'd be upset. Keep running! Bro is garbage. <laughs> Y'all seen that? Bro is garbage. Alright. Mari, keep running. I don't even care what anybody else does anymore. I'm just gonna start ending everyone's turns. There you go. You must escape as well. Hurry. I got you. You don't have to tell me twice. Yeah, you better run away pretty fast if you don't wanna die. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's follow Miss Mari. Yeah. That was strange. A mission where we don't kill the bad guy. Um. How do man learned endure? Nice. I'm going to start pumping up my magic even more. Well, actually. Yeah, 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 yeah. Once I get to like 22 magic. Then I'll start pumping it up in other stuff. Miss Mari, are you all right? She looks like like her hair is all fluffed up and stuff. She looks different. Yes. Thank you for your help. Thanks to you, she is safe as well. She? I am known as Kresnik. Kresnik. I am okay. destined to battle the fiendish vampire Kudlock. I hid within this body in order to avoid unwanted predicaments. A demon? You, you've taken over Miss Mari's body? You filthy bastard! <laughs> Damn, but I mean, hey, it is what it is. That's not what happened, Atsuro. I haven't been taken over at all. Calm down. Huh? Miss Mari? You're okay? What's going on? Yes, I'm alright. Please listen to what Mr. Kresnik has to say. Oh, so sorry. I didn't think a demon would be inside you, Miss Mari. Her earnest desire to find the one behind these bloodless murders summoned me. Our interest coincided, so a contract between us was easy to form. She and I both seek to defeat the same demon. He is a vampire that calls himself Kudlock. However, he cannot be defeated right now. Hmm. I mean, he was pretty easy to defeat. I mean, we, sh we should have just knocked him off there, but whatever. And on top of that, so that means that she also summoned a demon without a comp. I'm starting to get jealous, bro. Everybody's doing that. That reminds me. When you said to not kill him yet, what did you mean? Kudlock is a vampire with the ability to regenerate from almost any bodily wound. Unless defeated in the proper manner, he will continue to revive stronger than ever. So we're going to need a special thing just like before, like the Devil's Fuse to defeat him. If his strength is allowed to grow... Eventually, no one will be able to stop him. And a vampire that can roam in the daylight, that's, that's kind of scary. What's the right way? There is something required to defeat him. 
but there was a slight miscalculation. I'm sorry, Mr. Kresnik. My mistake, but you in danger. A miscalculation? The necessary item to defeat Kudlock had been stolen. He appeared shortly after. Stolen? Usually Kudlock would flee the area if he was aware of my presence. This must mean that the item's theft was instigated by Kudlock. Hmm. Where'd you have it last? I... I don't know for sure. I think it was probably at a park in Kanda. It's a powder made from white amnion. Miss Mari was carrying it in her bag. So everything will be alright if we get Miss Mari's bag back, right? Yes, that's it. You know what my bag looks like, don't you, Atsuro? It's the one you were always carrying, right? I totally remember it. Leave mm. it to us. We'll let you know the instant we find it. And she said the last place she thinks she had it was at the park. Oh, wait. Doi. Cell phones aren't working right now. How should we contact you when we find the bag, Miss Mari? Let me see. We can't fight Kudlock without it. So we'll lay low in Kanda. Gotcha. Gotcha. We'll go look for it then. That was... That was insane. And I'm pretty sure this next event is going to end day four. So let's go for it. Oh, it's a battle. Interesting. Hold on. Might as well go ahead and end the fourth day. This video. Hit the like button. If you're still here, you're a real one. For real, for real. We're, we're tackling a lot of stuff today. Uh, oh, or we can look for the bag. Let's definitely do that. I'm glad i seen that. Huh? Someone stole your bag? That reminds me. There was this weird guy who had a large bag. I saw him cross the... However the fuck you say that. And go north up the central street. Okay, what if I press it again? Oh, it's you kids again. Hope you find what you're looking for. Okay. See a man sitting on the park stairs who is rooting through a woman's bag. He has it. That's Miss Mari's bag. There's no mistake. Bro, it's always these weird workers doing stuff, bro. Mm. Who are you? Bro, shut up. I'm about to smack you. Hand over the bag. Uh, this weird guy asked me to do I it. I don't care. He said if I stole this bag, he'd give me some food. Bro, forget that food. Here, take it back. Yes. You see, I bet it's not going to be in there, though. All right, we got the bag back. But who's this weird guy that had him steal it in the first place? Probably Kudlock himself. He's lying. Yeah, that's probably yeah, it. Yeah, probably Kudlock. Okay, back to Miss Mari then. Bat, 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 bat. So it said that she's gonna be laying low in Kanada, Kanada Park. I didn't imagine that Miss Mari would be possessed by Krishna. Yeah, we found her bag. We need to get it back to her. Maybe it'll be like an event when I can do it. But she said she'd be laying low here, but it's not really an event, you know? Yeah, there's no event, but we have her bag. So whenever we need to give it to her, we can. I'm gonna save my game again and then... Demons? Well, this isn't good. They may be trained, but they've got no chance against demons. Come on! But be a massacre in the streets, bro. Did you hear what I said? Leave the food and money you stole right here. I didn't steal anything. I found this food. I've been searching for hours. I'm only gonna say this once more. Drop the food and money and scram. Yo, are these like corrupt police or something like that? I, I already told you! I found them! No, you stole them. And if you keep lying to me, I may have to use force. Oh my gosh, y'all. Ah, a demon! I'm not lying! Please, just let me go! I'm begging you! What a heinous crime. I'm sorry to inform you of this, but you get the death penalty. Bruh, and it, it's even worse because he has the voice of Kaido. <laughs> <laughs> die, 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 die! Oh, it's a tamer cop. Bro, that's crazy. Oh, Yo! Uh, I can't believe what I'm seeing. 
Yo. <laughs> this is what happens to liars and thieves. They're dressed up like cop. Did he just? Did a policeman really just? Or are they really policemen guy? and they're just killing people because they need resources? <sighs> this is fucked up. This can't be happening. This is so fucked. Huh? What are you kids doing here? What are you doing? Other policemen are doing their best to keep the peace. <laughs> Police, huh? Who cares about the peace? Who cares about duty anymore? The SDF are civil servants too. Why are they safe outside and we're stuck in here? That's what I'm saying, bro. If y'all want to kill somebody, bro, aim your fire at the SDF. It's still messed up. But, bro, <laughs> you're over here killing just innocent people that are just trying to make it, bro, that are just confused as you. I don't get that. Makes no Isn't sense. Isn't it their job to fight off intruders in the first place? Yet we're the ones who got stuck in this lockdown. What's up with that, huh? Still, that's no excuse for causing harm to others. What you did can't be forgiven. Who'd want to protect the civvies in this mess? The hell with that. Whatever, bruh. Let's whoop their ass. Let's just do what we normally do, y'all. <laughs> my bad. My headphones keep smacking against my mic. I know that's probably annoying for some of y'all. Berserk. Mighty hit. Yo, we can get... Ooh, a physical boost. Yes, sir. Alter pain. Restore some MP when damaged. Yo, these are electric amp. Yo, some of these is looking pretty damn nice. But as we've seen with the last one, with the Renegade, like the Shomenkai people, these can get pretty tough. And spreading out, everybody could get us killed. Uh, Ares Aid. Bro, all of these look good. What I want to get is Physical Boost. Um, what is Mighty called? Guarantee one critical hit. Um... I already got physical boost. Um, alter pain. All right, actually, we're gonna have obviously the main character go for that. Alter pain. Zero. You can go get physical boost. Um. Well, actually, those things are weak to electricity, right? No, they're not. They're with the fire. Yeah, it's zero will benefit from getting there. Electric amp. I'm so confused. Wait. Yo, why is this guy? Why does that guy have everything? That's stupid. I, I hate when like everything's on one person. Um, the current ones are all right, but we have the auto skill that like ensures every physical attack hits and eventually a crit's going to happen. That's a command though. Um, you know what? I'll get it. That's it. Adori, take him out. So this is what it's looking like right now, y'all. Alright, my bad, y'all. I am back, and it has been like three hours since that last clip. Like I said, y'all probably can't even tell when I cut since it, I'm not really doing edits. But we are back. <laughs> and I've actually decided to do a like very long episode because coming back after practice, I'm reinvigorated. This video is probably going to be like three hours. Uh, so if you need to come back, you can. Anyways... Now, we are starting the police fight. I don't know if I'll be able to crack all these skills. Alter Pain is definitely going to get got. I really want physical boost because if we can get that on Tsuro, yo, we are going to be eating good. So, let's dispatch our team and let's do it. Let's go after everybody. Dispatch. Let's do it. 
Alright, so. Kaz, your man's is over here. He's the police all the way over there. Nobody needs to get this guy, so you're gonna drop him. Police killing people is so wild, bro. That was messed up. Battle aura. I guess I'm not gonna get to know what that means for a while since I'm deciding to do a mega episode. Um, oh, we finally got Agidine. Yes, sir. And we finally got Holy Day. Bro, this is the team I wanted. That does so much damage. I wish y'all could see my face. That was insane. Okay, this is the dream team right here. This is Kaz's team working at maximum capacity. That was nice. You destroyed the comp. How could I lose to a bunch of kids? Kids are trash. Get on my face, nigga. Bitch ass. <laughs> All right. In this turn, Yuzu needs to go. Midori. I'm supposed to crack that. Yuzu, you need to attack him. You know what to do. Devil Speed. Once, you use, once I'm using Devil Speed on her, I don't think I can go back. I'm going to be real. I don't think I'm going to go back. Where is your respect for human life? Facts. Tell him. Tell him, you who. Alright. Electric Dance, maybe? Um, that's really all we can do. Seems like everybody resi resists on in this game for some reason. And mighty hit on. Um. Oh, I forgot. But Suro needs to get physical boost from him. Damn it, y'all! Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! Um. Honestly, it's not safe. Let's just guard. We can take count take down this thing. That's all we can take down. Nice. Dang, that sucked. I was, like, getting ready to just totally destroy his party. But I forget that uh, we needed Tsuro. Which, he, he moves next, so... We don't have to wait long. Ah, oh, what? I forgot. We don't have... Ah. That was looking sucks. I don't have it to where he can attack multiple spaces. It's all right, though. It's just going to take a little longer to do this mission, that's all. It doesn't make it any more harder. Dory, get to where you need to be. You guys fail at justice. Now you'll face magical punishment. Magical punishment. Midori's growing on me. Whenever she was on the receiving side, she really annoyed me, though. But, you know. All right, so. I was going to say fire dance seems like the way to go. We'll silence them. He's on. Nice. Okay. What? Battle Aura? I have no clue what that even does, y'all. So, so far, everyone's being slow at taking everybody out. Bro, are you serious? They're chasing the, the people? Oh my this gosh. I don't care. Don't kill him. Oof. Mission already over, huh? Damn it. That's sad, bro. Whatever. Here we go, y'all. All right. So the AI was being a little bit more nicer to me this time. <laughs> All right. Weak to ice on the right. Probably going to hit him with that. Um, 
Agidon is pretty strong. I'm gonna hit the power with that. And then Holy Dance. Hmm. Should F up everybody. Let's do it. Jeez, that was so much damage. Oh my god. Ice, ice. Yes, yeah, sir. Alter Pain. Got it. Alter Pain. Restore some MP when damaged. You destroyed the comp. What the hell? Damn it. I'll remember this. I don't care, you dumbass police. Over here killing innocent civilians. You're weird, buddy. You're weird, buddy. Alright. Now it's all up to... Use you to get her last crack skill. I've been holding off for so long. Um, put him right here. Still can't attack him just yet. Zero, move out the way. I'm gonna charm this guy just in case he tries to use a. Uh, Devil speed and attack him. Wait, hold on. Is there any way I can... Dang, I can't reach him. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Cops moving towards its hero. Bro. Just give up. Let me get... When I'm trying to get electric amp... That's all I want is electric amp. Come on. Bro. That's all you're gonna do? You're trash. You're wasting my time. Just let me kill you, bro. Just let Yuzu get to you. Alright, Yuzu. Your time to shine. Devil speed. Your time has come, buddy. Alright, let's do this. He's done. I think I know what Aura does too. Um. Yes, actually, because we use a lot of electricity for Yuzu. She has a forced boost for Zon, anti fire, life bonus. Um. Instead of anti fire, I'm gonna give her electric hand. But yeah, I know what it means. Okay, so if you're strong against the element, that doesn't necessarily mean you block it. But if you have battle aura, if you're strong against something, then you basically nullify it, pretty much. Which is pretty cool. Um, I'll put a lynch camp over that. Oh. Extort the comp. You're no ordinary kids. Uh, obviously. <laughs> we just whooped like eight cops. <laughs> That was pretty good. I'm happy that Kaz is at full power, That's bro. Holy Dance one, is actually OP. Damn it. That was just not right. I wish we could have saved the other person, too. I know. As soon as we got here, that dude got shot. Yeah. Sad. Oh, thank you so much. I don't know what would have happened if you hadn't come along. Brothers, demons, and then people. It is not a safe circle, bro, at all. This is like the Hunger Games. <laughs> You should find an area with more people. You'll be an easy target if you're alone. Yes, thank you very, very much. It looks like even police officers would abuse the power of the comps. Yeah, I can sort of understand how they feel, but still. Don't policemen have to fight for justice? How can they go around killing people? I don't know, right? It's kind of sad. I don't get it either. The world's gone mad. I guess you could say that. Yeah. Everything and everyone in this city is breaking down. Can it ever be fixed? Will we ever be able to go shopping or have fun again? No clue, man. That sucks. Not in three days. <laughs> Not in three days it can't. We'll fix everything. Yeah, that's right. Everyone in the area has at most three days left to live. If we don't like that, then we've got to do something to change it ourselves. Run up in the showman, Kai, and just make them uh, tell us. I want to do something about this. There's no way I'm going to give up. All right, let's go then. Yeah, I'll follow you anywhere. 
You say that, but I got a comment that said Keisuke and Midori both are going to be, like, going in and out of my party. So, we'll see about that. Um, Tsuru and Yuzu. Okay, so that's the end of day four. Let's save. That was a good day. Nothing too, too eventful. But we learned a little bit more about, like, Aya. We saved Haru. You know, we did a bunch of, like, logistics. It's starting to get dark. I feel better today, though, because you're all with me. Oh, right. You were alone at night, weren't you? You must have been scared. Uh-huh. Yeah, but now we know that, like, she can talk to demons, which is strange. Come sit by me. <laughs> You'll be all right now. Thanks. I'm happy for you, Midori. In any case, I'm glad we were able to save you today, Midori. Yeah. Um, seriously? Thanks. But is Keisuke gonna be alright? What happened to me is what got him angry. It's all my fault, isn't it? If only I'd listened to what everyone was saying earlier. Well, don't worry about it too much. We'll do something about Keisuke. But he's always been surprisingly stubborn. That's what I'm worried about. Yeah. Still... So much has happened today that I can't tell what's what anymore. Yeah, we should straighten everything out a bit. Um, first. Miss Mari, Shoji's information. Trying to recollect what she told us. She was talking about, um, angels. Like, she said a lot about angels and how the angels sent the SDF to do this and the government to do this, which is crazy. Because they knew about the Shomakai's whereabouts. The system server, that's more of what Tsuro's trying to get into. All right, let's start from the top. Okay, she and that Kresnik need the white amnion powder to defeat Kudlock for good. That's the stuff Miss Mari had in her bag, right? Yeah, we found Miss Mari's bag, so let's hurry up and give it back to her. Right, we have to remember to give her the bag tomorrow. All right, Shoji's information. Yeah, she said that the angels were pulling the strings behind the SDF. Angels supposed to be on the side of justice? I don't want angels like this. I don't know. It's obvious that there's more to this that we don't know about. Alright. They're going to kill us and angels in the city? Yeah, that's what Shoji said. I've never seen one, though. Where could it be? Well, didn't we see a, a Mane use one? Or if maybe that was just really what the players caused the lockdown, what are their motives? In the system server. The Shomunkai said that the server was where no one could reach it. I don't get it. How did it get there if nobody can reach it? Oh, if we could only find Naoya, he might be able to help us. Today was exhausting. I seriously wish I was on my futon back home. Everything's getting worse day by day. It's getting more dangerous in the city, too. I know. I wonder how many more humans we're going to have to fight. Yeah. The death clock's counting down, too. Belial, was it? I wonder what kind of demon that is. Hey, can we really beat it? Yeah, of course. I mean, we beat... We beat, uh... I already forgot. Belder. That man, Belder, was just... That man, Belder, We have crazy. to, no matter what. So, yeah. We're gonna win, and we're gonna go back home. Hey. What is it? You know how you stopped Haru from committing suicide today? I wanted to thank you. You're welcome, Yuhu. <laughs> I just did what I could. <laughs> You're strong. Whenever I've gone through tough times, it was Haru's songs that gave me strength. It's like, not the words or sounds, but her feelings coming through the music. I wanted to return the favor to Haru, even if I could only help her a little. <laughs> What am I saying? It's so hard to tell people what you're really thinking. <laughs> anyway, thanks. I'm really glad you were with me today. Bro, risen up. I mean, we did save a life, though. I mean, I deserve it. All right, anyways, starting from the top. This is Jin. Be careful. It's me. Your address showed up in my comp, so I decided to try sending you a message. I heard you're working with Tadashi Nikado? Who is that? I don't even know, remember who that is. His older brother was one of the victims of the bloodless murders. 
the one who found his body is a friend of theirs, Mari. Ever since, Tadashi and Mari haven't got along. Okay, yeah, Kaido is Tadashi, now I'm remembering. If anything else happens, I'll let you know. Shoot, I'm already ahead of the game with that. Um... Forget Haru. <laughs> Tell me about you, man. Alright. Let's escape. I want to get out of here as fast as I can. My boy's waiting for me outside. I want to be there for him before his operation. That's all there is to it. Oh, this is Honda. Even if he wasn't, I don't think staying in this Yamanote circle is a good idea. Is there any way out? Do we have to break through? See? I don't know why you didn't try to break, like, actually fight the SDF. Instead, you want to fight workers that are mad at you. Like, bro, what? Okay. Remember what I said earlier today about the guy who killed some of my crew? It looks like tracking him down isn't going to be easy. I know who you are. If you have any info, I'll pay you back. Lay low while I look. <laughs> this is Dolly. I finally understand what Keisuke was trying to tell me. But a hero is often misunderstood by the people, so I have to keep trying. I'm not going to go overboard anymore, but helping people isn't bad, right? So let's do this together. Yeah, that that's what we're talking about. Let's do it. Because before she was she was trying to get herself killed. Uh okay. Humanity leads me to despair. Attacking your fellow man in order to save yourself from the rigors of life, isn't it? Innocent and righteous people are being hurt because of the actions of the craven and the greedy. I cannot forgive this. These cowards aren't worth saving. In fact, they should be punished and made an example of to others as the example. Bro, Keisuke needs to chill out. I'm warning you because you don't get in my way, bro. Bro, stop emailing me like it. Bro, get out of here. Huh? We've been tracking this Yamanese circle for four whole days. How long do we have to stay here? Anyone can see that the gap between demon tamers and regular people is starting to get bigger and bigger. We're just kids. What do they expect from us? Facts. Let's do what we can, though. And this is Tsuro. Man, was I surprised. I never thought that there'd be a spirit like Chris Nick inside Miss Mari, and they'd both be chasing after that demon Kula. I hope that they can end those murders. Let's be sure to help them if we can. Alright, and then it says, Kaisuke is getting to be a problem, huh? I can see where he's coming from, but this is going way too far. Kaido is looking for the guy who killed his flunkies. We need to stop Kaisuke ASAP. For real, because can you really blame Kaido for avenging his friends? Like, Kaisuke is already a murderer, bro. That's, that's tough, bro. Alright. Day five, y'all. We done made it. Revelations. Yo, this is a first. They're using both screens to show something. What is that that opened up in the sky? It's like this portal. Oh, you're up. Morning. You're up early. Hmm? Oh, I was just going over some stuff in my head. Uh. Anything I can do? <laughs> Gonna help me out? Thanks, I can use a hand. It's about our death clock. Assuming nothing's changed, it should be down to one today. Bell's to blame for that. Mm-hmm. Yeah. If that guy in Shinjuku was telling the truth, we'll have to fight Belial tomorrow. Let's kick his ass. Think we can beat him? No, 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 no. I'm not gonna say think. He's going down. You're right. We have to win. We're all going to make it out of this alive. It's just, no matter how much info I sort through, there's one thing we don't know. What is it? The angels? Well, that might be related to it, depending on how you look at it. Basically, if everyone in the Yamanote circle is supposed to die in two days, how can we prevent that? What in the world needs to happen to bring back the peaceful life we knew? I have no clue. It's either the government's gonna nuke us, the Shomankai is gonna sacrifice us, or the angels are gonna sacrifice us. Uh, send the demons away. The demons have to die. Yeah, something with the demons, or they're not gonna Maybe release so. it. Maybe so, but we're only guessing. The more I think about it, the more I realize we don't have any assurances at all. Yeah, because even if we got rid of all the demons, they might not believe us. 
There's no proof that anything we do will mean we can go exactly. home safe for sure. Exactly what I said. I see. I wish I had some kind of proof. Proof that me, you, Yuzu, Midori, Keisuke, that everyone will be saved. Hmm. Let's find that proof. Yeah, we'll need a lot more information, though. We hardly know anything right now. I know, and we only have, well, our death clock says one more day, but really, we only have two more days until the seventh day. Let's pinpoint the cause of the calamity in two days and figure out a response to it. In which case, what we need to come up with next is who we can ask about all this. Obviously, probably Amane. Gotta make her talk. What about Azuna? Um, what about Shoji? Yo, I forgot both of these people. I'm sorry. Well, no, no, no. Shoji, she knows, like, everything. I, I would ask Shoji. But who is this Azuna girl? I'm gonna say her because I forgot who she was. Oh, Azuna. No, I remember her. She was with the, um, not necessarily the SDF. She's separate from the SDF. But she knew a lot of stuff. She knew just as much as Shoji. Maybe we'll find both of them together. Because if uh, y'all remember... Earlier, we had sent Shoji to go uh, talk to Izuna, basically. We told her to go to the tunnel. Hmm, true. She does work for the government. Plus, it seemed like she knew something when we met her last time. Let's go see her later. That reminds me. It's about time we got a Laplace mail. <sighs> I'm so sleepy. Morning, everyone. Oh, good morning, Midori. <laughs> you don't look quite awake yet. I see how Midori reacts to the Laplace mail. Yeah, still rubbing the fuzz out of my eyes. Hey, what's the Laplace mail? Hmm? Oh, it's email that only gets sent to our comps. Here, this is the one from yesterday. Atsura opens his comp and shows Mari the mail. I mean, I keep mixing up Midori and Mari and shows Midori the mail. Huh, the letters are all funky though. It's kind of creepy. Huh? Now that you mention it, the scrambled letters are getting worse. I wonder what's up. Is it broken? No, I'm not going to worry about it. <laughs> huh. Well, it won't be a problem as long as we can still read what it's saying, but... What? That's my name! Killed? In the underpass in Ikebukuro? Yeah, didn't we save you? I'm not surprised that you're shocked. These emails predict the future. We found out about the danger you were in when we saw that. Emails that tell the future? Then if it wasn't for this... I really would have... Yes, bro, you would have actually got murked. That would have been yeah. sad. Yeah. I'm sorry, I shouldn't have shown you that. Nope, it's okay. I'm just surprised. <sighs> I'm sorry. You shouldn't have showed Kaisuke's weird ass that. That's who you uh, shouldn't have showed. Um, <laughs> well, anyways, we use the Laplace mail as our guide for what to do each day. Oh, okay. Morning. Phew, I overslept a little there, huh? <laughs> Sup, you who? You're up early today. With everything that happened yesterday, I can't blame you for being tired. The Laplace mail's here. I hope we can use it to prevent disasters today, too. All right, let's see what it says. Yeah, they weren't wrong. Why is it blacking out everything? Or <laughs> white out and everything like it's a freaking middle school teacher. All right, at 12, a body will be found drained of all blood and the victim. Okay, so we can give Mari back her bag and clap that thing at 12, but... 13, Minato Kushiba by Tokyo Tower. More violence against demon tamers. Victim dead, Kaisuke. Suspect. Okay, so at 13, Kaido will kill Kaisuke. So we either got to show up at 13 or somehow distract Kaido so he doesn't even appear at 13. And then all day everywhere, rides intensify. Demon tamers become more active. And it says, have a nice deet? Death. Have a nice death? Who was writing these? They used to say, have a nice day. Bro, have a nice death is crazy. All right, y'all. What Damn the heck? It. It's just what we were afraid of. Keisuke. Mari Mochizuki, too. <gasps> is Kudlock going to kill her? Obviously, we got to go kill him. Damn it. Things couldn't possibly be worse. Hey, what are we supposed to do? Keisuke's gonna die! Shoot. One step at a time. <sighs> You're right. We shouldn't panic. But what can we do? 
There's only an hour between Miss Mari's death and Case Gay's. Is that time enough to save her first and then him? W we'll have Should to be. make it be enough time, or else that Kaido guy will kill Case Gay. Come on, guys, think, think. How can we save him? Let's beat up Kaido. <laughs> Let's beat up Kaido. Let's persuade. That's never gonna happen. Let's keep them apart. Keep them apart, huh? I guess if we do that, Case K won't die, but... No, that won't work. We have to address the problem, or it could happen some other day. We have to convince Case K to stop Yama's judgment before Kaido finds him. Convince him? Okay. Oh, Fine. but that won't work if this Kaido guy finds Case K first, huh? If we could stop him from looking for Case K for a while, we'd have more time. If we can distract Kaido with something else, that might give us the time we need. But what would catch Kaido's interest more than Keisuke? Mari, right? Yeah. That's it. If he finds out Miss Mari's in trouble, he'll head straight for her. But how can we make absolutely sure he goes to Miss Mari? We need to think of something that might distract Kaido from Keisuke to buy some time. Oh, I see. Yeah, you're right. Let's do it, guys. She got that Disney Channel voice, bro. Well, wait a sec. Huh? Now what? I almost forgot something important. Now you stuff. Oh, you're right. We have to go to the Shomunkai. <sighs> and we need a way to get rid of the demons so the lockdown's lifted. Bro, okay, this game's throwing too much at me. Huh. They're trying We've to confuse me on, on purpose. Our plate. Looks like we won't get a break today either. Hey, guys? I've been wondering for a while. Something wrong, Midori? It's not sunset yet, right? Is this a red sky in the morning? Yeah, I was about to say something about that because we just seen some weird portal thing that looked like it opened in the sky. And I was like, are they going to address that? And then I seen the purple hazy background, but I was like, maybe it's just they woke up that early in the morning. But nah, it's actually red. Huh? It's not sunrise right now. What the? The sky. No, the whole world is tinted red. What the hell? Damn it. Everything is changing. It's getting harder and harder to believe this is the same city we knew. Yo, this game is go- Whoa! Whoa! Yo, there is so many different places to choose from. I wish I could see my face right now, y'all. This is huge. Suspicious, man. Do you know why the government was able to carry out the lockdown? Normally, people wouldn't believe that demons could appear, right? They'd be even less trusting if the government says it. The answer is simple. Angels are behind the government. Those damn angels are trying to annihilate us every chance they get. He, he sure seems to know a lot. I like how, like, in this game, even though we're, like, the main characters, the there's still a good bit of people in the circle that is knowledgeable about what the hell's going on. They're not, like, all in the dark, and they don't need us to tell it for them or hold their hand. I like that. But, um, I was gonna make this a mega episode, but I don't want to mess anything up. There is so many people to choose from. Mari, the, bro. I don't know who to talk to. I'm gonna be honest with y'all. I do not know who to talk to. So I'm gonna let y'all give me a day five of God, and then we can continue with some more Devil Survivor. Love y'all. If y'all stayed this long, almost a two hour episode, bro, you're, you're really Zeltic Squad for real. Hit the like button, drop a comment, join the Discord, you know? We be getting lit over there. I love talking to y'all. Y'all are funny. And I will see y'all in the next one. Zeltic out. Peace.